answer and you can speak you can actually um, answer in vernacular in bisaya anyone how about christine gotcha are you the same can you relate on the picture Ma'am, excuse me lang po, can I have some, a little request, ma'am? Yes, yes po. Um, ma'am, if okay lang po, pag nag-answer sila ng Bisaya, ma'am, medyo pa-translate ng konti. Hindi pa kasi po ako ganun kagaanong sanay po na mag-Bisaya po. Actually, I'm just new here from Cebu. Wala pa po akong one year. Ah, okay. Yes, Okay, we will try to also translate that if our students would have difficulty, but as much as possible, we would like you all to be comfortable to your language. We will be the one to deliver that to you, Nico. Okay, any, anyone would like to share? Kanang from the heart, kanang maybe you have, you are, you know, like have some burden right now or everything is weighed heavily. This is your time to, you know, express yourself. Okay, silence means no. Oh, someone, Siklariane, is raised her hand. Um, hello, I'm Rizal Karyanis from grade 12 Saturn. And my answer is um, the performers uh, in acrobatic shows um, um, management because they manage how to... Uh, they manage how to balance it properly. So um, this uh, this performance is is we can relate it to time management because they are kanangi ilhag yung gi paning kamutan nga ma manage sila og tarong ang ang ilang performance. That's all. Thank you. Okay, that's a very good sharing. Thank you, Sir Kitoy. Okay, um, I have a question. Uh, what will happen if they could not manage the plate? What, will, what is the possible, um, what will going to happen if they are not going to manage the plate? So, Sir, um, Carl Patrick Nicholas po again for, <laughs> from Venus. Um, it will fall down and the plates will be broken. As you can see, that will show the things that will might happen to our life if we can't balance our goals. Even though we're trying to overshine others, outshine others, trying our best to do anything without focus and balance our, on our life, we always fail because we need that balance in our life. Not because you are smart, not because you are rich, you will focus only on that, some kind of particular thing. You also need to manage your time for, for socializing because every part of our life is important and every single thing has a purpose in our life. And if we don't balance it properly, like the plate, it will fell down and broke as well as our life. Thank you. Okay, that's good. How about Hiramis? Tara? Same sa ko answer, same sa point ni Nico. Failure ang may tabo if masubraan or di nila mabalance like that. Okay. Um, how about Maxine Kabual? Hiramis, you can just uh, click again the the raising hand. Okay, thank you. Kabuwal, Maxine, you're raising your hand. Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening, ma'am. So I agree to hear up his and Nico, sir, that if, if we fail to focus um, all those plates on um, they were trying to balance will eventually fall. So kung di lita magpinarong or di lita magfocus, basin ang unsa tong gi carry or unsa tong gi try nga i effort nga i balance kay mga tagak jud siya so wreck jud siya ang mahitabo so 
as much as possible kung we feel nga ka nang nang na na taog focus or we feel nga mo give up ta ka nang dili na jud ta mo give up kay experience man jud ang pinaka importante sa life kay experience not only shows us that ka nang kailangan nato ni kailangan nato na experience shows how we handle balance our strength and how we how we strive to um to achieve our goals and show that we can do great performance and live a good life and a productive life here on earth so that's all sir thank you oh thank you <laughs> thank you maxine by the way sir kitoy there is a message from our chat box that um most kuno ni share kay grade 12 Hi, Angelo wow. Narboada from grade 12. Uh, no, no, it's not that. Okay, hold on a second. I'll just have to see. Okay, as I can see, ma'am, mga grade 12 sila tanan. I don't see any of my schoolmates or classmates from Shalin, uh, Sean Lee Gabuli. Um, we would like to remind that this um, virtual, uh, shall we say, siya academic and holistic engagement, online engagement, So, which means that they are not here probably on grade 11 because of internet connection or other matters, that does not hinder you to share. Everyone here is equal, okay? So no one is, just because they are grade 12, you cannot share, everyone. So we're all in equal footing, okay? So you can openly share, okay? If you are um, not so confident to share your voice, you may chat it here just like she, um, she's, Telling it here. Hi, I'm Shello Narbuada from Great Venus. As I can see on the screen, there's balancing. I can reflect it in our daily task. For me, in my making decision, we need to balance something, not just focusing on one thing, but we need to learn, find something that is better. There is a collapse. Maybe a collapse would happen if we don't focus and try to balance things. Okay, thank you for that, Chi. Okay, um, can I move on? Go ahead, sir. Okay, um, as you can see my chart, you see my chart, I have nine plates to spin on. Can you imagine? I have nine pl plates to spin on. So, the expert says, um, nine plates is not ideal, but you can still do it. How can you manage if you if there are a lot of things to be done? How can you balance if you only have 24 hours a day and all of your work will exceed up to 30 hours? How can you balance? So it is difficult. So sir, with uh, this, makam. <laughs> sir, um, for me po para ma balance, para possible po siyang ma balance. We, some people, not mostly like. I know that they, some of us can't agree what I will say, but for me to balance those things, for example, thirty hours yung makokonsum ng work mo, you need to do a power nap. In short, po sir. You will you you need to master the power nap, which you you will just nap for thirty minutes and go back to work with multitasking. Like you will do things the same time. One good example of that is our mothers, the Filipino mothers, because you see our mother every morning they are cooking at the same time they are doing laundry, cleaning the house, taking care of brothers and sister, taking care of her husband. So that's the, what's, that's one of the good example of multitasking, sir. Because we Filipino, we always manage to look forward on everything, to find something, to complete a certain task. Yun lang, sir. Thank you. Idol mo talaga, mama mo, ha? <laughs> okay. Thank you, Nico, sir, for that um, beautiful um, um, insight. Wendel Murag din ajo ni mapugnan mo tingog na gyud ni o tingog na Wendel. <laughs> oh Wendel. 
if kwan sir kung daghan jug buhat ko non sir dapat mo kwan lang ka sir kana sa so, itawag ni sir kanang mo dili mo relax lang ka mo tanaw ka mo dili ka mag dili ka magdali imo i-focus mag-focus ka sa usa ka butang then once ka focus na ka dire na ka mag-start mo mag multitasking mo sa ni buhaton sa kung father which is kanang very efficient sa our daily life but tulo man mi ka book diri so we focus on one thing then diha na mi mag start og once we we focus na diha na mi mag start og multitasking so that is the additional answer o uh, makam answer sir kas basin wala niya napasabot ka im sir ba thank you okay thank you um a lot of you gave already an insightful um, explanation based on experience. That's good. Um, Maxine, I know her. Wendell C., I know him. He's a very hardworking guy. Uh, Maxine, she's a very um, inspired tita. <laughs> um, a, lot of, a lot of students in senior high school already demonstrated um, hard work and dedication that La Hoog Knight High School is so blessed because of your good example. Now, um, granting, because uh, as I can see, students can only have um, at least five plates to spin. Why? Because first, um, household chores, school, um, what else? Um, Part-time jobs. Um, what? 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 What else? Self-pleasure, uh, sir. Self-pleasure. What? Self-pleasure, po. Self-pleasure. Self-pleasure. Okay. And what else? Because we are teenagers, sir. So hindi oh, okay. mawala pa yun. That's socializing. Okay. So four. What else? Any more? The studies, sir. The studies. Oh, that's cool. Number three. What else? Bantay, sir. Bantay. <laughs> okay. Bantay, si bantay siblings. Okay, five. Any more? Chore, household chores, sir. Household chores. Oh, I'm chore. manang chow, household chores. Any more? So self, I think... Self-reflection, sir. Self-reflection. <laughs> well, Self-reflection. Okay. Kasi, kami, kasi mga teenager ngayon, sir, need, need moment to reflect yeah, yeah. and realize through their self. Look inside their self. Yes, uh, I agree with you, uh, Nico, because uh, my heart breaks when one of my students uh, told me, uh, she said that, Sir, muhunung na lang kong eskwela, Sir, kay dili na na ako mabalance ako ang time. It's, it's okay if di ni mo mabalance ang time. Ang pinaka sakit paminawon kanang muingon ba nga kapoy na mangay kinabuhi sir. This kapoy ni sige gusto na ko mo pahuway kana bitawng suicidal nga nga kanang sir sir, ba? sir excuse sir may dadagdag lang po ako. Okay. Kun din po to uh, self self learning din po to um, based on my uh -huh. self experience. Yes, Sometimes in life, po, sir, we experience hardships. We, exp we suffer from those fails and those fall. Every time we take fall, we need to, to stand up and learn from that fall. Because when life gives you a lemon, then squeeze it and start a lemonade business, as the businessman says. So, <laughs> kung ano man yung ibigay sa yung problema, huwag mo siyang tignan as a problem. Gawin mo siya bilang isang inspiration para mas mag-grow ka pa, mas maging maayos pa, mas maging okay pa. Although, andong ka pa sa point na feeling mo, hindi mo pa kaya. Pero, kaya mo yan kasi maraming nakasuporta sa'yo, mga nakapaligid sa'yo, mga nagmamahal sa'yo, kasama na dyan yung unang-una, yung family mo. Pero above all that, nakabantay sa'yo yung Diyos. At tanda kang gabayan kahit anong mangyari. Wow. Thank you, sir. Inspired si Nico this tonight ah. <laughs> parang 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 
inspired ah. Nasa tabi yung inspiration ah. Inspiration <laughs> sir. <laughs> May inspiration yan. <laughs> okay, so moving forward, we, we heard a lot of good things from you. And then coming from you that you really need to take care in spinning the plate. And then you're trying to take care of it, not to fall it down because it will break. So that is life. Um, the secret of spinning the plate is that you cannot spin the plate at the same time. You cannot, you cannot spin the plate at the same time. Why? Because when you spin the plate and then spin the other plate, and then spin the other plate, kanina five plates or six plates. You spin the other plate and the second, the third, the fourth, the fifth, and the sixth plates. Now you cannot spin at the same time. Why? You only have two hands. See? You have only have two hands to spin. How can you spin it at the same time? You cannot do it. The secret there is uh, which plate is going to slow down that plate you're going to spin and then find the other plate that we're going to slow down that's that plate needs to spin so meaning there is no such thing as division or making um your responsibility as divided to the other responsibility meaning you can go through um i will show you this one before i show you the the division of my duties and responsibility. Now, I can show you there is no more division and there is no more restriction. You cannot see a pie chart. You can only see a circle. And then all of my responsibility is there. Now, what is the secret? I have to spin the nine plates, but I cannot spin it at the same time. All I have to do is to find what are those responsibilities that needs to be spin? Do you get the point? You need to identify the responsibilities that needs to spin. Example, I, I gave you deadline, accounting. I gave you deadline next week. Which one is needs to be spin? Tiba? Obviously, the one who has a deadline. You will not going to spin the other subject because they don't, have, they don't have deadlines. So logically, you need to find those subjects that you are behind. That subject that you need to really cope up and then try to align yourself in the, in the, in the proper way, in the proper pacing. So that is how you manage, how you handle, how you identify things that are needed most. Did you get the point? Um, I have a lot of experience with, with, with my students. I want to tell you all of my, I love all, all of my students. What break my heart is that when they, when they tell me, Sir, kapoy na jud kayo, sir. I cannot do it. And then, I don't know what happened. I, I cannot intervene what really happened to them. I can just only give them advice on how to move your life forward. A lot, a lot, um, uh, Nico, uh, I understand your point. Pero you are so blessed because you have your parents behind you how about those students who do not have parents behind them i didn't say that they are nobody loves them nobody cares to them but in the fact that they don't have parents to push them forward they only have friends to push them forward give them words teachers they will give them words but when they are alone when they are in the dark Everything will come to them and all of that discouragement will come to them because they could not spin the plate. They could not identify which plate needs to be spun. 
So, what are the things that we need to do in order to really help ourselves out? How can we manage the plates to be spin? Um, si Hiramis Muragni raised the hand. What can you say? Ko answer ka nang um morag take one at a time kay kuan man good sir for for example karon same same mo giingon sir ngon anak pud ko wala wala parents nga mo push na ko then ko answer ka nang ana mga module gitambakan ako sa module nya akong buhaton sir in order to makapas gyud sa deadline kay dili na ko siya idungan bali ako siya ng take one of at one at a time para ma-focus ko og kanang sakto akong mabuhat gani sir maora <laughs> good um you have a good decision and then you have a good mindset and then hoping hoping the same all of the student na mag-think ba the same like you are thinking that way. But there's a lot of students in Lahug Night High School who are very discouraged. And then we could not, all of them, we don't have the, the we don't have power, you know, <laughs> to really kanang hug them or reach them out in our hands because our hands is limited. Um, we, 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 we just have a, a experience of breaking our heart. <laughs> That's why we are so much thankful. As we can see, wow, we are 58 students now. Um, that's a good news. Um, Lahug Night High School students are willing to learn. That's, that's a good sign. Even though you are so busy, but still you come in. You are here trying to listen and then try to improve. Um, and then Mom Buley and I are, are so much grateful with that. And then our heart is jumping. <laughs> so, but uh, Makam, um, do you want to share? You're raising your hand. Yes, sir. Um, dag -dag clear pa ba, sir? Clear pa yung bosses ko, sir? Yes, loud and clear. Sir, um, dagdag ko lang din po sa sinabi niya, sir. Um, ito rin po based on my own experience. Alam niyo naman po yun, sir, di ba po, nung first semester kung ano po yung nangyari po. Actually, first semester po sa lahat po nang hindi nakakaalam. Ako po yung pinakamabait sa grade 12, Venus. <laughs> late na late lahat ng grades ko. Wala first quarter hanggang second quarter. Although na-down ako nung time na yun, pero... It doesn't matter kung down ka man ngayon. Ang importante kung paano ka babangon bukas kahit na sabihin mong wala kang parents. Hindi yun importante, hindi yun nagmamatter kasi hindi lang naman tayo sa parents natin kailangan kumuha ng inspiration. Although kailangan na kailangan natin yung guidance nila but we have our second parents like our teacher and also we have kung mga nagsisimba man po andun po yung mga pastors po natin yung mga priest para Gabayan pa po tayo para hindi tayo mas para hindi tayo madown pa lalo. And mostly meron po tayo mga friends although sometimes sa, aminin man natin aminin man natin no hindi minsan na mga kaibigan natin mga sira ulo yan. Minsan sila pa yung magdadala sa atin sa kalokohan pero in times of need andiyan sila para damayan tayo. So wag kayong magpapadown masyado sa mga problema kasi ang problema problema lang yan hindi naman tayo bibigyan ng just ng problema. Kung hindi natin ito kakayanin. Kaya huwag kayong madown. Sinabihan ko nga po yung kagroup ko, hindi ko na siya papangalanan. Sinabi niya sa akin na wala naman daw pakialam sa kanya yung parents niya. Sa pag-aaral niya, sinabi ko sa kanya na kung alam mo lang kung ano yung nangyari sa akin, kung bakit, kung bakit grade 12 pa lang ako hanggang ngayon. At to be honest po, um, tumuko na sa akin yung mama ko para pag-aralin ako kaya andito ako ngayon sa papa ko. Pero... All those things na nagawa ako in the past, doon ko kinukuha ngayon yung mga lessons na unti-unti ko pa po natututunan. Although hindi pa ako fully matured, aminado po ako na may mga times na isip bata pa ako. Pero yun nga, huwag tayong magpapadown sa problema. Always 
wear our smile because we are Filipino and one of our strength is our undying will and also our love to each other. Yun po. Thank you. Wow, nakakaiyak naman. <laughs> I recommend Makam. That's really good. Um, you really have a good experience. You learn from the past and then what you are right now because of your past and then you overcome those challenges. That's a good thing. If you overcome the challenges, you will you will become a better person and a good person and a very insightful person. That's a good thing. Now I will going to move on. Um going to move on the slides. Next is that here you can you can see uh there's a six plates spinning and the other plate is five plates spinning. So what I'm trying to what I'm trying to share to you is that there is a variation. There is a variation when when you spin a plate. Sir, excuse me, alam po, sir. Excuse me, lang po. Um, oh. kindly please pa unmute po ng mic kasi nag-interfere po sa background. Hindi ko mas hindi po masadong maintindihan. Hindi. Okay. 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 Sir Kitoy? Yes, Sir Kitoy. You are heard. Yes, it's loud and clear. Yes, sir. Okay, na, na mute na. Okay. So mm -hmm. this are this is my explanation on how are we going to believe from all of those responsibilities in spinning the plate. As you can see, there's there are five plates, six plates, and nine plates. Now, if you have a lot of plates that you are trying to spin, you need to focus the essentials. What are essentials? You need to focus the most important things in your life. I know you have a lot of plates to spin, but the most important things in our life, example, the family. Our family is the most important plate that we need to spin all the time. If you have kanang offensive or kanang nahiubos ka or something na ay mga misunderstanding sa yung family, it's not time for us to move away. It's time for us to stay. Stay with our family because that is the one is one of the essential in spinning the plate in our life. What else? Our studies. Whatever happened to you, do not decide to quit school. It will, it will not bring you a bright future. It will just make you dumb. Dumb meaning you will not improve. You will stay what you are. So that's the sixth, the second essential. What is the third? Your friends. The fourth, church. Church activities, pastors, priests, mga church friends nato. So those are the essentials. Focus, focus your attention on the essentials, and then most likely your life will going to be easy. Now, as you can see, uh, five plates, six plates, nine plates, and then spot the difference. If you will maximize. The plates, example, you are now spinning five plates and then you are trying to spin another plate, total of six plates. So to maximize, there is a negative percentage of your um, allocation. Example, when you have, when I have depth as a teacher, when I have five plates, I can spin the plate 44%. Now, when I have six plates, I can only spin the plates 42%. There is a variation depending on how many plates you are spinning. So did you did you get did you get the point? So that is that is the logical, then the nearest logical that we're going to happen in order for us to really identify and balance what are the things that we need to do. What are the things that are essential that needs to spinning, that needs to be um, maintained, that needs to be uh, cultivated in order for this 
um, responsibility to flourish and to become um, successful in the in in the way as we move our lives. So kana siyang different. I'll just showing you the variation on depending on the place you are spending. So the more the more plates you are spending, the allocation of your percentage of every responsibility will be reduced. And then every responsibility that you are going to turn down, meaning imuhang gikwaan ang imong responsibility, so those allocation of percentage sa ubang mga responsibility will increase. So that is how you maintain the balance logically in your duties and responsibility every day. So that is a good uh, measurement in calculation, having a basis on what are the things that matters most and what are the things that we need to do. Are we going to focus on playing cell phone, playing, scrolling down um, Facebook, or are we going to study our lesson and improve every day? So you need to identify making a list on how to spin the plates. Okay, moving forward. Um, if you have questions, you can just um, raise your hand along the way. And then I will present to you a management framework. This is a management framework. A management framework has five elements. As you can see, there is five elements. First is values, mission, strategy, priorities, and measurement. Now I will going to focus on the values first. Why values? Why we need to focus values? Okay, I will going to, sh to show you as a video clip. Um, uh, this is this person that we're going to talk. Um, he is a therapist. At, you know, therapist, when there is a problem, whether it is mental problem or family problem, or any kind of problem related to a relationship, the therapist will find ways on how to mitigate or how to lighten, not eliminate. We could not eliminate, but we could somehow lessen the demand of sufferings or challenges. So I, I want to focus first in values. So I will show you a video clip, this one. And then try to listen um, the words that he is going to share to you. And then make a reflection on yourself. Okay? So just um, give a silent moment and then try to internalize the words. One of the things that I think is really helpful uh, in healing, Sir, kids, whatever is there any the, audio? the problem is, whether that be depression or. Wala audio, ma'am? Yes. Wala audio. Wala audio. Meron po sa akin, ma'am. Meron po sa akin, ma'am. Meron, meron. Meron po sa akin din, ma'am. Meron po okay. din sa akin, ma'am. Meron na. Okay. Uh -huh. So, can sige I continue? Po. All right, sige. Sorry, sir. Please. One of the things that I think is really helpful uh, in healing, whatever the, the problem is, whether that be depression or the addiction or anxiety or whatever the problem might be, is to understand that there's a difference between my image and my identity which a lot of people haven't really given a whole lot of thought to, that there's this thing that I'm concerned about, and that's what other people see, mostly. And that's where I put most of my energy into understanding this. And so when a problem comes up, like addiction, like uh, depressive symptoms, whatever those things are, I confuse the two. I think because I have these thoughts or because I have these behaviors, that must be my identity. And so those two things kind of overlap and they, the boundaries are, are very um, shady. 
And so to really sort of understand what my identity is and where that identity comes from and then to understand what my image is. Because both of them are important. I would never say that the, the just forget about your image and just focus on your identity. But really understand who you are, where you came from, why you're here. One of the favorite questions that I ask in almost every session that I do, have you figured out why you're here yet? And that answer usually changes. In the beginning of treatment, somebody will usually say, I'm here because, and they'll list off some, a list of behaviors or a list of problems, something that's troubling them. But as they go through, as they understand their own identity more, their answer will change from the surface type stuff because all of those first answers are all about image, right? Those are surface things. But as they start to heal, they start to understand that core identity better. And all those things become a little bit separated. So the boundaries between the image and the identity start to differentiate in a really powerful way. It's not, it's not a total cure, but it's, it's a powerful first step to understanding that that's just because I do that doesn't mean I am that. And so understanding a little bit more about what that identity is has been one of the things that I've, I've tried to get a, a better description or better handle on. The best things that I can, can advise people to do is to make a list of what their values are, what their virtues that they, they like, things like honesty and integrity, things like that. Not, not really considering what my behavior does, but what my values are. That's where we get confused. We think that our behavior is our values. I have a high value, uh, for example, on honesty. It doesn't mean I'm always an honest person, but it means I, I, I do value honesty, and that's part of my identity. And so what happens is when I behave dishonestly, it is in uh, conflict. There's this dissonance that happens, and I don't feel good about myself, and I start to listen to that voice that says, you're a dishonest person. Well, it's not true. I behave in a dishonest way, but I still have a value on honesty. And the way that I know I'm not a, a, a dishonest person in my core is because I have that friction. I have that dissonance. It doesn't match to me. I feel badly about it. It's causing this, this uh, depression. It's causing anxiety. It's causing me to have a dysfunction in my life in some, some way. Okay. Um, who would like to share the insight about the video? <laughs> did you did you get the video? Is it clear? Sir, na disconnect ako. Yeah. Would like to share. Silence means nobody. Oh, Maxine, thank you for raising your hand. Go ahead. Good evening again, sir. Good evening, ma'am. So evening. as I've seen no. sa video, ma'am, sir, um, ever since nag-start ang pandemic, ever since na, na puto lang atong pakipag-socialize, we have this sense na kanang murag kanang na isolate ta so nahiwalay ta sa atong mga source of like happiness source of kanang stress relieves na to muna nga kanang murag nabaghuan ta sa atong environment so diha na nagsugod ang kanang mga anxiety mga depression kay nahiwalay lagi ta sa ato ang kanang mga pa-socializing na to nga mountain abnormal Oh yes sir nahimo tang ang imbis na normal way na to of kanang living murag na shake ta kanang nabaguhan jud ta sa atong bagong environment ron mo na nga dinha nagsugod ang mga anxiety sa mga especially sa kabataan ron sir nga kanang naatay natay shift sa modality na to sa kanang pag skwela nga which is kanang dili jud na to naandan mo na nga kanang we struggle and then eventually nay uban nga 
too much na ang kanang ilahang problems nga kanang dili nila mahandol na lead sa ilaha sa depression so nakita na sabtan nako sa video nga kanang naatay image og naapod tay identity so ang atong image kay mo na atong kanang outer kanang makita sa mga tao na to bang atong gipakita nila nga oy nakakita sila nga kanang broken ta nakita sila na sad ta unya pero sa deep inside kita ra jud nakabalo on sa atong problema on sa atong problema on sa tapagkatao which is our identity so dili jud sila kayo mag cross kay ay dili jud sila kanang as in mag meet kay ang atong image kay may pakita na sa tao pero di jud nila masabtan unsa ang atong identity so kita ra jud nakasabot ana which is very important na kabaw jud ta sa atong identity and that's why we set values kanang unsa to ang gi-stand for muna nga atong gi-fight nga kanang muna atong tinuhuan pero agree pod ko nga kanang kung unsa tong tinahuan usa hay dili sa nato may pakita sa tong behavior kay ang atong behavior kanang dili man nato mahandle sometimes kay dili man ta perfect pagkatao pero that doesn't mean jud sad nga kanang wala nato gi gi reflect ang atong values we just sometimes na jud nga kanang ang atong ang atong kanang human nga kanang nature kay dili jud dili jud mo exceed sa ato ang kanang atong expectations nga pero we always have to keep in mind lang jud nga kanang kanang we have our identity and we sometimes have to just breathe in and breathe out and kanang sing give a path to ourselves pat lang ba imo hang ipat imo self kung walay na adiha walay mong friend or wala kay family you always have to remember nga na imo self you have your identity you have yourself to comfort you you have god to comfort you god that always um guides you and protects you and always loves you no matter what you do and no matter how imperfect you are so we all, we just always have to believe in ourselves and believe in god and have stronger faith that's all say thank you wow <laughs> that's um sure uh, uh, sir very, dadag- very kanang very large and very informative um very <laughs> I I can feel that you really set values in yourself, Maxine. Um, that's a good thank example you, of yours. Um, thank you for um giving that explanation to really comfort those students who are here. Na it seems their life is hopeless. It seems that because they are like this that's their identity something something that they 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 are confused about um we really we really need to understand the identity you know you know um uh prayer ni nico ganina he prays about father god heavenly father so meaning there is a god in heaven our father meaning our identity belongs not in this mortal mortal earth but we really came from our heavenly father so if we if you if if the student really understand that that is their identity that they have father in heaven who cares for them see you know as you can see he is our father in heaven. I, I know you cannot understand what the father is because student pa mo, anak lang mo, pero I'm a father. Ako as a papa, akong gusto sa akong anak, mahimong parihas na ako. Mau na ako ang gusto sa akong mga anak. When you think of it, ni heavenly father, the same way of thinking. Heavenly father wants us to be like him. Nakita ninyo ang relationship. Heavenly Father wants us to be like Him. So meaning, our identity is not limited in this mortality. Our identity goes beyond going back to Him, like Him. So if you say that I am, uh, I am doing this, behaving like this, 
that is my identity. No, that is only an image. You can still you can still value the values you have, even though you did mistakes. Because in si Maxine, we are not perfect. We can do mistakes, so we are not perfect. It doesn't mean that we are bad. It's just a manifestation of we are not perfect, and that is not our identity. Our true identity is to go back to our heavenly Father, to be like Him. So whatever problem we encounter in this life, it doesn't mean that nobody loves us. Kamu ni anak mo nga, somebody love us, the Heavenly Father. Yes, that's true. That should be a, a mindset to a student. That should be the correct um, mindset to counter problems, challenges in your life. Diba, daghang kag problem ang student, muduol na ako, sir, kapuya na yun sa kinabuhi, sir, mas maayo pang mawa na lang kung kalibutan na. Ako, sir, naminaw ko niya, sakit niya akong dugahan, kaya nga naman, Heavenly Father loves you so much, wala na ni mo makita, wala na ni mo ma-feel, nga dako kayong gugma si Heavenly Father ni mo, nga si Heavenly Father gusto niya mahimu ka, nga parihas niya. Diba, kung niya anak ka, Wala na'y pulos ang life, sir. Gusto na kong mawala ang kalibutan na. That is not true. That's only an image. That is not your true identity. So, in order for us to establish identity, to really understand identity, we will set values. So, as you can see, in the management framework, the first thing that we need to establish is values. Now we need to manage right the spinning of the plates. We have to establish values first. Atong i-value ba? Kung unsa jud mga importante, importante ba ni siya? Importante ba ni um mo mo laag ko or mo tuon sa ako or later na nang laag. So you need to really establish values. In yourself. When you Sorry, establish excuse. values, so you can already see, identify um, things that are essential. When you, when you put first the values in yourself, then it is clear for you to see and identify which are the, which are the things that are matter most in your life. So, kana siya. So, and then the next, the, the next time around is the mission because you already set the values and the next time is you are going to have a mission. What is your mission? Grade 12 student, my mission is to graduate this coming no, graduation <coughs> ceremony. <coughs> Makam, no, no, would you sir. like to share? <laughs> sir, excuse me, sir. Um, idadagdag ko lang po dun sa explanation po kanina nung nauna. Um, okay. Dun, based po dun sa pagkakaintindi ko dun sa first part ng video, although hindi ko siya natapos. For me, we can't be defined. Hindi tayo pwedeng i-define dun sa spitting image natin. Because there's big difference between identity and image. May mga time po na kung sino pa yung mas mukhang inosente, kung sino pa yung mas mukhang mabait, kung sino pa yung mas mukhang walang ginagawang masama, sila pa yung mga tao na hindi mo alam, titirahin ka na pala patalikod. Kung sino pa yung, kung sino pa nga minsan yung malapit sa'yo, yung mga kaibigan mo, may mga time na hindi mo ini-expect na sila pa mismo yung sisira sa'yo, sila pa mismo yung aatake sa'yo. And isa pa po, sir, there's big dip there's big, there's big difference between image and identity. Para pong, para lang din po siyang sa pagkakaiba ng persona and being. Thank you, Makam. Thank you, Sige Nico. Po, sir. Um, kinsa to? Okay. Ingon si Nico, kung kinsa tong mga uh, sino pa yung mga mga ship ship image ba na mababait para sila pa yung mag-ano but 
if you as a person already establish the values those things around you negative things around you will just be eliminated nga naman you will focus to the values after having establishing the values you will going to have the next element of management framework is the mission what is my mission what do i need to do in order to succeed i'm a grade 12 student i need to be i need to do things and comply all the things for me to graduate so you need to set values and the next is your mission so can i see? so um thank you so much for all of your uh, sharing um mom Violi, i think we already have uh, it's 919 uh, 919 mm. so <laughs> yes, sir. It's a very good input, no? And then you mentioned about the values. So, ako lang siguro ang i-add on sa values yes, is, like, for example, example, you as a person, ka na naay mo, betray ni mo, even your ka na family or close friend nga, okay sa mo in front, but nagtalikod ni mo, betray na ka, gilibak na ka. I think your value is forgiveness. Yeah, you're willing yeah, to forgive wow. those who hurt you in anakintahay or you would like to have that value of positive mind nga because siguro gi, gi betray ka because nasuya sila sa imuha so instead of you as a negative person or so you kind of have that kind of shield bita with all these negativities around you have that strength and then Sir Kitoy is integrating mano the the faith of our faith in God. So I think that's very important nga. no matter how or what others would do against you, you are strong enough because you have your own faith and you have your own values. You have the positive mind. You choose to be silent. Yeah, she. it's also a very good weapon no, nga you are silent instead of hurting back others. So even if it's a bit difficult to forgive. Time will eventually allow you to forgive that someone. No, 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 no one can tell, or even you yourself. Na, Hello, okay, na lagi me. So time can heal. So kana nga value nga you let time pass para ma okay mo. That's true. Okay, yes. So thank you very much. I know it's already nine twenty one. Ganahan mo ani guys nga kind of session. What do you think? Yeah. Mas maganda yes, ko pag may ganto. Kasi nakakamiss din mag face-to-face, ma'am. Right. <laughs> yeah. So, I did not share this to grade 11 um, GC Circuit Toy because we already have our page. I would remind them later on because we were also busy in school today. But we will do our best to have it next week if we could. Weekend may be possible. We will today. Can anybody tell us a little bit of a summary? What was our topic today and what did you learn? Okay, anyone? How about those who did not yet share their opinion? On say atong topic today, on say na pick up ninyo kang Sir Dennis Kitoy's input. <laughs> Anyone Silence. would like to raise their hands? So we could... ako na lang po. Okay lang, ma'am. Hindi ba nakakasawa ni bosses ko mo? Ah, sige. Ni... <laughs> ma'am, right, sige today po. po. Today po, I learned lots of things, especially managing time, balancing all your goals, especially po unahin ng, unahin po natin kung ano po yung pinaka-importante po talaga sa goal natin. Kung sa akin po, kung tatanawin niyo po kung ano po yung pinaka-una po sa akin para sa akin, second lang po ang family because overall of everything, God is always first. God is al always everything for us because through God, we can do everything. And God will give us the strength to manage our time, to balance our time. Tapos po, doon din po sa value, dagdag ko lang po ma'am sa last na sinabi niyo ma'am. Hindi, hindi po sa, hindi natin kailangan maging bitter pero kung may, may nakagawa man sa atin ng mali, isipin niyo na lang po. 
Jesus Christ na anak ng Diyos mismo handang magpatawad para sa atin. Tayo pa kaya na tao lang. Dapat po tayo matutong magmahal at magpatawad po sa kahit sino mang nakagawa sa atin ng kasalanan. Kasi po kapag hindi tayo marunong magpatawad, hindi po tayo tatanggapin ng Diyos sa kanyang kaharian dahil wala siyang anak na hindi marunong magpatawad. Yan lang po. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Very good, Nico. No? And someone said it here. It's all about time management and balance. Also, giving value to yourself. Hala, na-summarize ni she. And also, <laughs> balitulu atong maestro, maestro Ron. He, he. Yes. So, you, as you can see, Nico also has the voice for tonight so that you see we allow him to express himself so next time it's encouraging you all guys to have your time to shine right nico wow <laughs> yes Wala na everybody, everybody has a voice wag kayong mahiya kasi lahat tayo <laughs> meron tayong kanya-kanyang kwento na dapat nating i-share na mali wow. mo maka-encourage sa iba yes. kasi lahat ng mga pinagdaanan yes. natin kahit na tingin natin yes, na very para sa iba. Good. Para sa iba, encouraging siya. Tapos pagkukuhanan siya ng strength. Di ba mas maganda na naka-inspire pa tayo all those hardship na pinagdaanan natin? Yes. Okay, Nico. Very good, no? I hope that you are also inspired by Nico's input tonight. And another thing from Sharon Manuat. She said that para nako wala koy friends. Fam ang nagisaligan only self and my own family ra labaw sa tanan ang kahitasan. Okay Sharon so I think yeah you may have that perspective now maybe later on mo usab pa na siya but no it's a very good thing that you are all sharing. See we are open opinion. Okay, so Dalhan King, salamat guys. And Sir Kitoy, can you please have your last message and for our prayer? Pwede ikaw mo manage for our closing? Okay. Um, uh, my heart really rejoice because um, not only a lot of you participated, but it shows that you learned something tonight. And then I feel your kanang sincerity. Um, I feel your kanang hopes and dreams. Na hopefully you will manage, and then you can balance as you establish the values in your life. Um, always remember, kung gisultin yung ganina. Um, with all of the plates that you are going to spin, you cannot spin them at the same time. There is always a time to spin those plates that are needed to be spin. So all you have to do is to manage, find it out, identify those plates, and then with with your values in your life the most important thing the first element in doing the management framework is establishing the values it's difficult for you to jump on your mission if you don't establish your values you really need to establish values first because when the when the path is kanang shady or kanang you don't you don't understand what what happened and then the hope is kanang disappeared you can always hold on to your values and then you can always depend on to that values and then when you reinforce that values everything will be put into places uh, I, I experienced that personally in my life. And then I believe for myself that establishing values will really fuel, fuel strength to your mission. And then after your mission, you can have your strategy. And then when you have the strategy, you can have your priorities. 
And then with all of these four elements, you can now have your measurement on how to identify which are the things that you need to focus on. So I hope that uh, every one of you um, enjoy tonight and then hoping to see you again uh, next time. And I hope to see you again next time. Uh, Mom Buley and I really enjoy this moment to really impart our, our knowledge to, to help you see the bright future in your life. Um, to close this, I would like to ask anyone to, to volunteer. Who would like to volunteer for a closing prayer? Silence means. I think just... we have one unmute person, Janmar Bantasan. Wow, thank you. Junmar, wala may bosses. Sir Kitoy, can, shall we have the prayer over our students? Can you please lead on? Ako na lang. <laughs> yes, sir. So we could have this prayer over. I think it's it would be best that it's coming from us. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Um, we bow our head for our prayer. Our most gracious and loving Heavenly Father, we are so much grateful for the time, the gift of life that we have. And we are so much thankful for all of the opportunities that we have. We are so much thankful to our families. We are so much thankful to our friends. We are so much thankful for all of the teachers in La Hoog Night High School. We are so much thankful for all of the learnings and uh, opportunities to improve for ourselves in order for us to establish and achieve our bright future. May Thou will um, guide us and give us the strength to continue to move forward even this challenging time. Uh, may Thou will enlighten our burdens. May Thou will soften our hearts that we are willing to listen and paying attention to what is really essential that is that matter most in our life may thou will guide us with thy spirit that will give us inspiration and direction that we will always choose the right and do our duties and responsibilities may thou will bless us all heavenly father with good health and strength may thou will bless our minds that we may always think, think those things that can help us improve. May Thou will continually bless us as we continually move forward and doing our duties and responsibilities here on earth. This is our prayer. We love this so much, Heavenly Father. And we pray this in the sacred name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Okay, so thank you very much, Sir Kitoy, for the day. And before we leave this Zoom, can we please open our camera for our documentation so we could all see you guys? Is it okay? Before you leave, can we have first our picture taken wow beautiful face open your video <laughs> yes i'd like you all to open your yeah. your videos this time for the first time i saw your face <laughs> <laughs> yeah and i'm really trying because you know my internet here is not stable so i cannot see the others can you see them circuit toy because i can still see your you're sharing the screen, so maybe we can stop okay. this so I can see 
them opening their videos. Yes, ma'am. Um, okay. I will Sige. stop the screen. You already yes. stopped the screen, ma'am. Uh, okay. It's still there. I think my internet is really slow. Oh, stop. Okay. Oh, na na. Okay, na. Yeah, very good. Okay, please open your video. I'll count her 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Hello, wala na nag open ng uban. 3, 2, 1, smile. Okay, and another, another lang ha. Five, four, three, two, one, smile. Okay, thank you so much, everyone. Good night, and see you next weekend. Okay, goodbye. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much okay. for the opportunity. Bye. Thank Circuit you so much. Boy. Thank you so yes. much. Yes. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you, so much. Thank you, thank you sir. Bye. Bye. Nico you and again. all. Bye. Thank, see you and those who did not share. Please share next time. <laughs> Bye. We are so excited next time. Sige, I will leave. The... Yeah. Bye. Bye. management. Okay, bye-bye. We will now leave this. Ah, okay. Sige, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.